Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Lane. Today, I'm doing a realistic rebuild of the Atlanta Falcons. And we're going to do something a little bit different. In the draft, we're going to take a quarterback, either Trey Lance, Kyle Trask, maybe Justin Fields if he falls to us. Because I'm going to play this out like Lawrence goes to the Jaguars, Wilson goes to the Jets, Bengals, you know, takes a well, easy slam dunk pick. And then we'll play with Matt Ryan for a year, then either cut or trade him. He's going to regress anyway, so it's not really going to matter all too much. But we do have to work on the offensive line a little bit. Carpenter, Matthews, Mack is getting up there in age. I like Caden Hurst, but kind of old at 27 years old. He probably won't be on this. Uh, let me say that. Kind of old in terms of Madden. Not in real life. I get that. We have Julio Jones. We have Calvin Ridley. Love those two receivers. But we all know Julio Jones getting up there in age. is 31 years old. Gurley is our running back. He won't be here long term. Then on defense, I actually like a lot about this defense. With Keanu Neal, Jones, Allen, Jarrett, Davidson, who has hidden development. Dante Fowler is on the team as well. Let's give it an Ottawa line. That looks a little bit better, but I believe we have to re-sign Keanu Neal after this year, which I'm going to try to do. We have A.J. Terrell, who they just drafted. But let's mess around with the scheme a little bit. I'm going to go run and shoot. I'm going to change this to Tennessee's. This is typically what I do for all my rebuilds, by the way, starting like recently. Where is Cleveland? I feel like I just went by it. I guess not. There it is. Okay. Let's go to... Actually, we have to work... That's just the specialty stuff won't really matter at this point. I am starting before week 16 when they play the Chiefs and lose to the Chiefs, but let's get right into it. We did not make the playoffs. That's a given. We went 5-11, and tied with the Panthers. Saints 12-4, and the Bucks 11-5. and Ryan 4,500 yards, 25-12. and That's not great for his weapons. Gurley, 10 touchdowns, not bad. Ridley, 1,309 touchdowns. He should go up. I don't know if it'll happen, though. Jones, 870 with three. Obviously not great for him. He was banged up a little bit. Six for Gage, four for Hayden Hurst. On defense, Loken, 112 tackles, 109 for Jones, 104 for Neal. Sack total, seven for Jones, six and a half for Jarrett. Interceptions, three for Wilson, two for Jones, and a few ones. We're 15th in offensive yards. Let's take a look at defensive yards. 29th. Yikes. Mahomes MVP. No Falcons. NFC is Kyler Murray, Offensive Player of the Year. Cook and Cousins up there. There's Matt Ryan at seven. I don't understand why. Defensive Player of the Year, Devin White, Pierre Paul, one and two. We have a Loken at eight. Offensive Rookie is Gibson. That makes sense. Defensive Rookie, there's A.J. Terrell at three. And that's going to be it. Now, the only person on the team I want to check out is Davidson, the defensive tackle, because he has hidden development. Yeah, because there's not going to be much for XP. Ridley did have one. But Davidson has star development. All right. Wow. Absolute domination. The Packers beat the Chiefs 42-14. to I was not expecting that. Gurley, I'm going to let him go. Cool. We'll bring back. Might as well. Nobody else down here. I don't know what we have for money because I want to bring back Keanu Neal. I think that's who I'm going to focus on primarily. Even if we don't have to go to free agency, that'll be fine. Was it Alex Mack the picture? I could have sworn Alex Mack was there. Was that not his? Like, maybe I'm losing my mind, but I thought that was Alex Mack. I, I guess I'm just wrong. We're going to bring back Koo, and then we're just going to go to the draft. Now, I don't think Zach Wilson's going to be there, so we're going to take Trey Lance, like I said. We're going to give Matt Ryan one more year, see what he does. 71 overall, hidden development. 96 throw power, 70 deep XC, 74 medium, 79 short. I'm just interested to see how this is going to play out. In the second round, I'm going to take Tyson Campbell, the corner. He's a 73 normal development. Why would he be hidden? 92 speed, 76 man, 75 zone, 64 play rec. In the third round, I'm going to take left guard Ben Brown. Not great. 66 overall normal development. Yeah, he's not great at all. In the fourth round, I'm going to take center Trey Hill. He's a 66 overall as well normal development. Yeah, not great. I was hoping for hidden and maybe he takes over for Alex Mack, but... I guess not. This game makes no sense. We're at 77 overall team across the board. Ridley did go up to X Factor, which is fantastic. Like I said, Matt Ryan's going to play for one more year. Don't have a running back, which is unfortunate. Then on defense, Jones, I believe, is up to superstar. Jared also, I think he might have been superstar. Loken up to star. Davidson starting a left end. We do not have a free safety, which is unfortunate. I want Campbell to be our number two guy for now, just so he gets a lot of playing time. Gage, that should be fine. Yeah, that should be fine because I want to get him up to star. Uh, maybe I would put Ridley there, but he's already X Factor. That's really the only point of that, just so we can get all the all the yards, all the touchdowns, get upgraded. 
So I think we're going to be fine. Let's go to the playoffs. We actually made the playoffs with a wild card spot at 9-7. and seven. Did Matt Ryan feel the pressure? Did he feel the heat of having a rookie quarterback starting behind him? I like to think yes. But then we are playing against the Giants who are 9-7, and seven, and that's definitely a problem. We're going to be one and done. Panthers, Saints, and us all 9-7. and seven. And then Tampa 6-10. and 10. I wonder, ooh, 5,000 yards, 42-10. and 10. He really did feel that pressure. Rushing, Williams 594 with 4. Jones 1,400 yards with 6. Ridley 1,100 with 6. Gage 1,000 with 12 up to start of Elamate. Hurst 982 with 12 as well. Jones 138 tackles. Sack total 7 for Fowler, 4 and a half for Alokin. Interceptions 3 for Jones, 2 for Neil Hawkins, the Terrell, 1 for Alokin, and 1 for Campbell, the rookie. So we're fourth in offensive yards. That makes sense. But did the defense improve? Oh, it did. It did big time. Matt Ryan, MVP. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. NFC offensive players, Matt Ryan again. Defensive players, Aaron Donald, but Deion Jones at two. Offensive rookie. I mean, we're not going to have anything up here. Where did Wilson go? Oh, football team. Interesting. Oh, no, we do. We have Williams. Defensive rookie. We have Campbell at seven. Good, good, good. Now, I imagine Trey Lance has star development, if I had to guess. I mean, there's no way he has superstar. 5 XP, though, being a backup, really not that bad. So we don't have a ton of XP, which is perfectly fine, but 3 for Ridley, 3 for Gage. What about on defense? Eh, I mean, a good amount. Davidson with 4. Let's hop into the game against the Giants. Here we go. A rainy, rainy New Jersey. Who's going to score first? They kicked a field goal. We're not going to do anything. Matt Ryan just went off to the moon. Thank you. It's 7-6. to six, About to be 13-7. to seven, Exactly. 14-13. Score again. Score again. This team's useless. The Falcons just, they know how to fall apart. They're going to let me down. It's only a matter of time. I don't care this 24-16. to 16. Wow. Good job. You actually beat a team that the Madden loves in the Giants. I'm impressed. And it's Daniel Jones, so I'm not as impressed. But 3-12, two touchdowns. Nothing for Williams. Whoa, what was that? Coleman, interesting. Ridley, 84 yards. Hurst, 127 with a touchdown. And a touchdown for, of course, Julio Jones. Top into the next game. We're playing against the Dallas Cowboys in Dallas, of course, with a wild card team. Who's going to score first, though? It's going to be them. Yeah, this is where we fall apart, right, Matt Ryan? Matt Ryan? Matt Ryan? You only got a field goal out of that. How did we get 11 points? Oh, he must have went for two? What do you say to your guys after? Prescott didn't even do anything. Two interceptions. You're gone. Long gone. The Pats ended up beating the Dallas Cowboys 24 to 17. I mean, we're bringing back Calvin Ridley. Is that really a question? Alok is up there. Hurst is up there. Well, this is going to be unfortunate, isn't it? Who are we going to bring back? Gage is up to start of element. But we can, I mean, we can replicate that somewhere. Ido Smith, Ido Smith, however you say it. I guess I'm going to franchise tag. Really? Are they even going to let me franchise tag him? Okay, that's good. Let's franchise tag him and I guess go to the draft. So we have the 27th overall pick. There's easily the middle linebacker, even though we have Deion Jones. Or Conley, the left outside linebacker. Which I think will fit our team better. So I'm going to go Conley. God damn right. He's a 75 normal development, ranked number 5. 80 tackle, 81 hit power and speed, 89 acceleration. In the second round, I'm going to take another outside linebacker, Warren Young. He's a 71 normal development, 75 tackles, 77 hit power, 83 speed, 91 acceleration. So we are a 78 overall team, not getting much better. Lance does have star development, by the way. Matt Ryan's down to a 73. He is not doing anything. The offensive line, not good. Tight end, not good. Receivers are perfectly fine. Still don't have a running back. On defense, Fowler's up to superstar development. Conley is starting. Hawkins up to star development. Terrell up to star development. And the computer drafted a right end. Hidden development, 64 overall. I mean, what's he going to have? Star development, not that surprised if it does happen, which it probably will. This team's just in a weird spot. I don't, like, I don't know what to do with it. We almost have to cut Matt Ryan year one. And, and, like, I don't like to do that because I don't think that's going to happen. Bonds, that's fine. Fowler, that's fine. I'd rather have, where is he? I'd rather have Conley, but let's do that really quickly. To the playoffs. We did not make the playoffs. We went 7-9, tied with the Panthers. Saints 13-3, and, and the Bucks 9-7. and seven. 
Lance, though, 4,600 yards, 35 and 14. Awesome. Probably should have had him start year one, but it is what it is. Williams, 590 with three. Bonds, the rookie, 13 yards, eight touchdowns. Six for Ridley, 10 for Thurston, eight for Jones. On defense, Deion Jones, 103 tackles. Sack totals, five and a half for Fowler. Interceptions, two for Jones and Terrell, and a few ones. We're 18th at offensive yards. That's not bad. Lance, number two, come on. Come on. Lance is going to win Offensive Player of the Year. We don't have a running back. Defensive Player of the Year. Nothing. Offensive Rookie. Bond's going to win it. That's good. Thurston at five. Defensive Rookie. Conley. Perfect. That's going to be it. But I'm very excited to see Lance's development. And he should go up to Superstar. Five XP. That's going to get him up to what? An 81 overall? That's, that's not fantastic if we're being fair. On defense, Conley has only two. The Saints beat the Chiefs 32-17 to to win Super Bowl 57. Now, Grady Jarrett, he's coming back. I mean, that's a slam dunk. A Loken, Lindstrom, definitely. Fowler, we can let him walk out the door and we finally have some money. All right, get him out, or get him back, I should say. Fowler, goodbye. Sheffield, I don't know. If he'll take three years, I'll bring him back. I want to go to free agency for once. Maybe, I don't know, find a running back. That might be nice. I'm going to give him three years. I'm going to increase the money a little bit. 8-2, 11.87. That's good. And I know we drafted a guy last year in Young. But we're going to have Conley start. Then we'll have a Loken. We'll have Young as a backup. McGrary. Mm, I see. I, I'm going to... Let's let him go. We could finally... Or probably find something better in the draft. So I made offers to Hardman, McCoy, Aquara, and Madison at running back. Now I know having a start... Oh, look at that tablet. Just right in his body. This game... Well made. Just so well made. This game's awful. Um, let's advance the week. Now, I know that having a star development running back doesn't really matter all too much, but I want something. I thought McCoy was going to be the slam dunk of all of them. Why is he accepted our offer? Thurston at star development. We don't need Zach Gertz. I'm just kind of confused that Eric McCoy didn't sign with us. I don't. I gave him the most money. Okay, we got the end. That's good. Who's the fifth year option? AJ Terrell, sure. Now, there's not a lot up here that we need. So, what I'm going to do is take the Heisman, a strong safety. I know we have Keanu Neal. We'll make it work. 77 overall, hidden development, rank number two. 87 speed, 78 zone, 71 tackle, 83 pursuit. In the second round, I'm going to take a left end, Jamal Spillman. He's a 74 hidden development, 78 power moves, 64 finesse, 81 speed, 87 acceleration. So we are an 83 overall team, 84 offense, 83 defense. Lance is up to superstar, which is fantastic. We don't have a right tackle, don't have a great tight end. Let's put Thurston up there, though. He is star development. Oh, because he's our fullback. Really going to do that to me? Let's put him down. Let's put him up. There we go. All right, so we have Ridley, we have Hardman, we have Jones, we have Bonds. I thought about trading Julio Jones, but... I feel like he's going to be one of those players to just stick on the team until he retires. But Presley is over to free safety. Spillman starting a left end. So we do have some rookies on the line and in secondary. So that's good. Uh, who are the specialists? Jones, let's not make that happen. Let's make it Bonds. And let's make this Spillman. And then we are good. We snuck our way into the playoffs at 8-8. Eight eight. That's kind of unbelievable. Playing against the 49ers who are 11-5. Saints 12-4. Bucks 8-8. Eight eight, the Panthers 5-11. Lance, 4,600 yards, 34 and 11. Madison, 760 with 8. Ridley, 1,100 with 6. Thurston, 988 with 8. Pretty good. Bonds, 891 with 3. Harmon with 11. Julio? Only 1. Jones, 100 tackles. Sack total, 7 for Jarrett. Interceptions, 3 for Presley, 2 for Jones, 2 for Campbell. And a lot of 1s. We're 7th in offensive yards. I feel like our defense was good, but I might be wrong. But how are we 8 and 8? 7-2. and two. Lance, MVP. Love it. NFC is Trey Lance. I love that as well. Defensive player. Nothing. Offensive rookie. Defensive rookie. Presley won. Spillman, two. Perfect. Even Bishop at eight. I think Presley. I know he won the Heisman. But I think he might have X-Facts. This game does like to screw me, though. I don't want to get too excited. Six for Lance. That'll get up to a 90. as the plus three. So I don't think I'm insane. Four for Thurston. Two for Ridley. Three for Hardman. Three for Bonds. Let's see it. Yes, X-Factor and Superstar. Superstar. I don't know if I'm pointing at it correctly. Superstar. Right there. 
It's kind of hard to point. You know, I don't know. I have a green screen behind me. What do you want from me? All right, let's upgrade the team. Let's hop into the game. This is going to be a tough game, but we're hopping in against the 49ers. Oh, uh, that was going the other way. I was like, how do you not score any points down there? 0-0 after the first quarter. 3 nothing. Quite, I mean, we were the, what, second-ranked defense, so this does make sense. We're up 17 to nothing, 17 to 7. Yeah, we're, okay, we're going to go to the next round unless some... Unless some Falcon like... Okay, we score. That makes you feel better. Did they just win? I don't know if he's happy or not. He kind of looks sad. All right, we did win. Cam Newton. Yeah, right. Lance 267, 2-1. Madison with a touchdown. Touchdown Bonds, touchdown Thurston. And that's going to be it. Let's hop into the next game. I mean, we shut them down, basically. We're playing against the New Orleans Saints. Let's see how this is going to go. Our defense should be able to slow them down. We scored somewhat easily. And then they scored somewhat easily. So let's see what's going to happen. 14-7. to I actually think we might go on a nice little run here in the playoffs. As an 8-18. and eight team. I have so many questions. But hey, we're definitely going to win this. Oh right, yeah, game over. There's six minutes left. They're down by 14. I guess let's not get ahead of ourselves, shall we? Why do the Falcons do this to me? They make me worry every single time. Who is Tanner Morgan? Lance 281, 2-1. Madison, three touchdowns. Damian Harris. Touchdown Smith. Touchdown Bonds. Touchdown Williams. All right. To the NFC Championship. We are in Lambeau Field playing against the Green Bay Packers. Let's see if we can slow down either Aaron Rodgers or Jordan Love. I would have to imagine it's one of them. We are up three to nothing. This has me worried. This has me worried. It's seven to three, 14 to three. Don't let me down. That's all I'm asking. We know I'm at Ryan. We should be fine. It's 14 14. Stop him. Okay. I still don't know how I feel. It's 17 to 17, 24 to 17. We're running out of time. Hello? We didn't win the Super Bowl. They're like, you're not that bad. You're not that bad. <sighs> Lance, you did nothing. 306. Rodgers, two touchdowns. Williams with a touchdown. Why is Gage there? Why? Why? Why me? The Packers beat the Chiefs 35 to 14. Is that Deion Jones? It is. He's coming back. Julio can go at this point. Matthews can go. Walker can go. Davidson. We don't need him. Oh, we have so much money. So, so much money. Hennessy, I want to bring back. Hawkins can go. Let's give four years for Hennessy. He's the best we have at left guard. Matthew Stafford? Yeah, let's bring back Matthew Stafford. Why not? Why is that even an option? All right, so we're going to have about $50 million. I kind of want to bring back Julio. If he takes this, fine. If not, fine. That's fine. What's the franchise tag? Nope. Let's go to free agency. We made offers to Tyron Smith, Ayuk, and Jake Matthews. Both of the offensive line. We lost, you know, Julio. We'll bring in Ayuk. I think that'll work out perfectly fine. Let's advance the week. Did we get him? Really? At least we got Matthews. That's fine. Let's go to the draft. With the 29th overall pick, we're taking corner Ronnie Wheatley. He's a 75 normal development, rank 10, 90 speed, 74 man, 69 zone, 74 player rank. Who was the 10th overall pick this year? Wasn't it like Isaiah Simmons? He might have been like eight or nine. But imagine them not just having normal development. Just, just imagine it for one second. And you're going to realize it doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Now, whatever we take in the second round, it's not going to really matter all too much. There's a tight end I'm not really interested in. Let's get another corner, Bryson Clinton. He's a 73 normal development, 17th. 94 speed, 67 man, 74 zone, 72 player. So in our final year, we're an 86 overall team, 88 offense, 85 defense. We really did nothing for this offensive line. I guess we brought in Hill. That's all right, but that's really nothing. We did bring in Thurston. We signed Hardman. We signed Ayuk. We drafted Bonds. Lance is up to X-Factor, which is awesome. So that does give us a chance. Then on defense, I mean, Jones, superstar, X-Factor, Alokan, superstar. But somewhat the same. What do we even do here? Presley, Conley, Spillman, I suppose. Brought in Okwara. I mean, we did all right, but didn't really get any corners or anything like that. Let's go work on the specialist really quickly. Check out that slot receiver, which might be... Yeah, I thought so. All right, let's go to the playoff. Hey, hey we won our division at 12-4, and four, playing against the Giants again. Saints 8-8, eight and eight, the Panthers 6-10, and 10, and the Bucks 3-13. and 13. Lance 4,800 yards, 47-8. and eight, Back to back, two-time MVP. Madison 7 touchdowns. Ayuk 1,100, about 1,200 with 13. Ridley 1,100 with 12. 6 for Harmon, 10 for Thurston. On defense, Campbell, the rookie. Oh, no, not the rookie. 
but 106 tackles, not bad. 14 and a half sacks for Spellman, seven and a half for Jarrett. Interceptions, four for Jones, three for Neal, two for Campbell, two for Terrell. And let's take a look. Fourth in offensive yards. How are we in the 11th ranked coach? Is Dan Quinn. Seventh ranked defense. Lance, I knew it. Back to back. Uh, where are we going? ANFC Offensive Player of the Year. I mean, he's still going to be up there. Defensive player, Kamal Martin. I don't know who that is. Spillman at five. Offensive rookie, Hauser at four. Defensive rookie, Wheatley at seven. Interesting. Now, we don't have any hidden developments. So let's just upgrade the team. And let's get into the game against the Giants. Now, I'm hoping since we're at home, we're in a dome, we should be able to win this game. How do you get all the way down within the 10 and you don't score a touchdown? That was them, so I'm not really that upset. But it's 10 to 7. Don't be one and done. 17 to 7 at halftime, 20 to 10, 20 to 14. Losing the game really quickly, 23 to 21. Down by one, up by seven. Tie ball game. Ooh, is that going to be good enough? All right, you're right. One win down. I wish we got the first round by, though. Lance, how'd you do? Three interceptions. Three touchdowns for Barkley. Hardman touchdown. Ayuk touchdown. Harris touchdown. That's rough. Let's hop into the next game. We're at home against the Washington football team. Very interesting. I think they got Zach Wilson, if I remember correctly. They're up three to nothing. Three to three. Why can we never score a touchdown when we're in the red zone? Thank you. Ten to three at halftime. Put up some more points. 17 to three. I think we might be going to the NFC Championship game. Definitely. 24 to 10 with this defense. Yeah, okay. We're going to the NFC Championship game. We won 27 to 10. Sorry, Ron Rivera. Get out. How did Lance do? Hey, 333 with two. Madison touchdown, Thurston 71, two for Ridley. Touchdown for Reggie Haw. We are at home against the Seattle Seahawks. So the first round seed, they lost. You hate to see it. Not really, but we're up seven to nothing. Seven to seven now, a little concerning. 10 to seven, 17 to seven, 24 to seven. Yes, 24 to 14. Okay, we're scoring another touchdown. They marched downfield, only got a field goal. We're going to the Super Bowl, baby. Yes. Get out, not Pete Carroll. Hit the bricks. 38 to 24. Lance, 302, two touchdowns. Wilson, 211, two and three. Awful. Touchdown, Madison, Carson Williams. Ridley, two touchdowns. One for Ayuk, one for Lockett Smith. That's going to be it. We are heading to the Super Bowl. We're playing against the New York Jets, who do have Trevor Lawrence. I have to imagine that's who they got in the first draft. They marched right downfield, but so didn't we. Our defense needs to show up. 14 to 7. Don't let them score. Stop it. It's 14 to 14 at halftime. And it looks like we're moving downfield. 17 to 14. Get in the end zone. 21 to 17. Another field goal. We lost because we didn't get the two point conversion. What a disappointment. Lawrence, 303 and 1. Lance, 266 with a touchdown. Touchdown, Williams. Touchdown, Ridley. Touchdown, Jones. Julio Jones. No. No. There's just, I don't get it. Crowder, touchdown. Jones, Ridley, touchdown. Touchdown, Phillips. I'm at a loss for words. But that is going to be it for this video. Hit the like button down below, the subscribe button down below. Go check out my Twitch, twitch.tv slash Live. I stream every Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.